Welcome back to another weekly grocery haul. Um, I know this is going up late because I only just got back from London, as in uh, I left the hotel at 6.45 this morning, and other than stopping at my house for about 10 minutes to uh, shove some food down my throat and drop off my suitcases, uh, I immediately went to get uh, my groceries and only just got back, and it's uh, 7.08 p.m. right now, so... I've been on um, the road for about 12 hours now, so if I sound a bit frazzled, I am. And also, there's a good chance that I've forgotten some things, so I might have to pick up a few produce things tomorrow. But uh, hopefully I did get everything. But yeah, let's just uh, get into it. So as always, we'll start with the produce. I got some potatoes uh, for, among other things, tomorrow. I'm going to make a sauerkraut stumpelt, so that's sauerkraut, which I still have in the fridge. Uh, mashed together with um, potato and I'm gonna serve that with uh, some roasted ham and uh, I feel like there was something else but I can't think of that right now. Some green beans just to have on the side. Uh, one thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make some keto chicken nuggets so this would be a perfect side for that. Uh, I still have a bunch of cabbages in the pantry, a, a purple one and a green one. Uh, so I'm going to make some coleslaw with that. Uh, I have onions, but I did not have carrots anymore, so I got a carrot for that. Some uh, chilies and some peppers, and honestly, I can't tell you at the moment what they're for. I just know I needed them for something. Oh, some tacos, I believe. And oh, I wanted to, wanted to roast some peppers to go on uh, like a chicken sandwich. So, uh, and then some apples for my fruit for the week. So... Yeah, I still have a few things like uh, onions and that sort of stuff in the house and the cabbages. And I'm going to do coleslaw for several meals this week, so... I know it's not a lot of produce, but it should be enough. So, the produce this week came down to 10 euros and 44 cents. And then I have some, uh, some meat and meat replacement, dairy, that sort of thing. I got these uh, fake chicken pieces and this... Uh, a vegan burger for meatless Monday. I'm gonna do some burgers. I still have some uh, burger buns from last time and These are for next week, but they're on sale and I also I got a gift card uh, with a lottery that I play here Every year you get a gift card for a uh, vegetarian and vegan and sustainable items So I got that from this and I still have a little bit on that uh, gift card for getting something like next week or the week after so uh, some ham to roast tomorrow to go with my sauerkraut. Uh, some bacon for some pasta later in the week. Ah, another thing I'm going to use some peppers for. Uh, so I'll use one of these uh, things and the other one will go in the fridge for another time. And some ham for some sandwiches tomorrow. I might do ham and cheese because I still have some cheese. Uh, and some uh, cream cheese. I don't know what I'm going to use that for yet. I might use that with my pasta or I might save that for another time. But it was on sale this week and it's been a while since I got some cream cheese. So I picked that up. So on meat, dairy and meat replacements this week, I spent 20 euros and 18 cents. And then we have everything else, which really is not a lot. Uh, I got my uh, Sugar-free soda, the cherry ones, it's they're still on sale, so I picked that up. Uh, then when I was in uh, London, I went into a shop called Iceland and I saw these cheese-flavored sauce. Never tried that before, but I'm going to make some uh, burgers. Uh, so I thought that might be nice to try in a big barbecue sauce that I don't see here. So I just picked that up. My two bars of chocolate for the week, and I got the honey, salt, and almond. And my one bag of chips for the week. So, really not that much this week. Uh, that came to 12 euros and 87 cents. And that makes the grand total for this week. 43 euros and 49 cents. And converted into US dollars, that is 47 dollars and 12 cents. Now, if you like to see what I do with all of this, every Sunday I do a Sunday prep day video where I prep for the week. So I'll cut all my vegetables and I make some things that take a bit longer. Uh, for instance, I'll make my uh, my coleslaw and everything tomorrow, so I have that ready to go for the week. And also, if you'd like to see what I eat, uh, you can check out my Instagram where I post every single meal. But also, uh, uh, yesterday and Friday last week, so two weeks in a row, I did a video of what I eat in a day. So uh, 
One was a vacation edition from uh, Tuesday to Friday, and one was a f uh, Sunday through Friday, basically a whole week of what I usually eat when I'm on my diet and not on vacation. So, um, is there anything else I need to say? Um, yeah, if you like this, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe, and thank you for watching. Until next time, bye for now.